Hey guys, it's Angela. I'm going to do um, some more ornaments. I got these little wooden ornaments from Michaels and I'm just putting some tape on a little over half of them um, just to kind of, I want to keep the paint off of the little cuff area. I think I might want to paint some of them white and I might paint some of them a different color. So I don't want to paint the cuff on all of them. Um, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a balloon smash on them, or at least that's what I think I'm going to do. So what I have here is a canvas that unfortunately was broken. Um, so this is just kind of a, it's a dirty canvas, not really good for much. <laughs> and um, I'm just going to pour some paint in some puddles over here. Um, and... I'm going to do kind of like blues and silver and some gold, kind of non-traditional Christmas colors and, oops, and kind of, okay, here we go. Just kind of see what we can make. I haven't decided what I want to do with the back side of these. I might just make them one solid color. But so in theory, just kind of do this and let's see, we'll go for this one. Literally just smash. And dip and smash. <laughs> this would be kind of a fun kid activity. Probably should be doing this with my son. I do have another package of them that I could do with my son. Um, Of course, if you, the more you smash, the muddier it gets. And every once in a while, you kind of just want to clean off your balloon. Just with a paper towel. And I'm going to just add some different colors here on the canvas, just in kind of a little different order. take you in for a quick close-up. So here's what we've got so far. It just makes a really cute little pattern on them. I like it. 
I'm curious to see if I'm going to like them with or without the cuff. So, we'll see. Um, we'll see how these dry. Okay, so here's what I've got. These are dried, obviously. And I peeled off the green tape. And I went ahead and um, painted the tops. And I actually painted the backs in a similar color. And just did the back a little bit darker on the bottom. Oops, sorry. Um, so yeah, here's what we got. I think I like them better with the cuff. I only really left one without the cuff. But... I don't know. You guys tell me. What do you think? Um, the problem is, is if I don't tape them off first, I started to do this one here. It kind of, you can see sort of how it messed up a little bit there. And I kind of messed up on the side. So this one I'm kind of considering a little bit of a fail or a little bit of an experiment because I just took a marker to try to personalize one. And obviously the marker is not going to be the way to go because this was also kind of a little blip blip mess up one here. Um, but again, I painted the backs. Sorry, my hands are full of paint. Um, painted the backs. And yeah, I like how they came out. So I think I'll do some more colors. And I think I'll put them on Etsy and see how they go. Um, but I don't know. What do you think? And then this was just like a little test of a ribbon. Maybe I'll do twine. I don't know if it's worth personalizing them or not. I think it might be harder to personalize them. I think it might be easier just to kind of send them as is and then if somebody wants to put their name on them they can but I don't know I kind of like them without it too anyway thanks for watching hope you enjoyed this and I will see you guys next time